off to the running shop today woo, um, to go and get some new trainers because I've had some nasty trainers the last couple of years. For how many years? Um, probably about 10. Um, so now I'm doing a wee bit more running. I need to get some proper trainers. So I've got some money for the birthday. So off we go. So we're going to go to run for it in Edinburgh and we're hopefully going to try out the the machine, the treadmill that can help you figure out your gait for your running as well. So hopefully get a bit more information about how I run and how or how I should not run and how I should run. And then hopefully we're going to look at purchasing a pair of trainers. And we we're looking yesterday and we we're looking at some reviews and things and we'd love to get some ASICs, some, uh, what are they called? Nova Blast 3. Nova Blast 3. Um, and I have to choose a colour and all that kind of stuff. So that is, that's, the, that's, the, that's the number one. That's the number one. And then if we don't get that, then we'll have to have a little look at what else there is available. So, yeah. Off we go. Do you have another nest? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ooh, new trainers! <laughs> <laughs> so excited because I got some new running shoes and um, this afternoon we went to shop in Edinburgh run for it and we picked up a good pair of shoes and so spoiler they were not the ones that I thought I was going to get but I'm happy with them so I want to take a moment to show you guys uh, what I got and uh, yeah really excited for this uh, I guess uh, I'll, the first time I'm going to buy proper running shoes I think the shoes I had before from the gym etc I've had them for like 10 years and they're not great anymore um, and so it's definitely been a long time coming and getting some new trainers. So went and uh, yeah it was cool, it was a bit of overwhelming as a total novice to what you should get, what you need to get, all the, the compression, the you know how wide or you know all the different aspects of your shoes uh, it should be um, but uh, I got a pair and um, so I think I managed to try on about six or seven different pairs as well. They've all got their own you know, strengths and weaknesses as well. But what I really liked, I'll start um, went in and uh, Gantt Shop was really helpful and we went on, I got to go on the treadmill to check out my running gait. So where they check your ankles, your knees, sort of your hips, kind of like they're all running the right direction so that you can get the right pair of training shoes, running shoes. So uh, I was able to do that and yeah, it was I think the feedback was I was, I was normal, <laughs> not special in any way. So and that was good because I was a bit worried that you know I wasn't running properly or I was overcompensating one way or the other in my ankles or knees, but so far so good with that. So not at risk at the moment of injuring myself uh, through my running style. Um, but yeah, I got a new pair of trainers and uh, it's great because the ones I had before were like 10 years old um, and no no compression, uh, pretty hard on my feet, so probably not been great for my knees as I've been trying to get going uh, running. So, great. Um, so, let me show you what I got. I've got a uh, Mizuno. Here's the, the box they came in. So, pretty standard shoe box. Yeah, and um, Mizuno. So, I hadn't heard of these before, but I think they are pretty decent running uh, shoes as well. So, uh, the ones I got, so we tried different ones, Asics, uh, New Balance, a few different ones as well. And um, as someone who's never really tried running shoes, there, there was a lot of similarities. I couldn't tell the massive difference between them, but uh, these were probably the most comfy ones. So uh, here we go, uh, some Mizuno, and they are the Wave Riders 27, uh, recently out. So um, what I really liked about them was that they were comfy right through as well. They feel like they've got a really good ankle support. Um, I think growing up I feel like I had sometimes weaker, weaker ankles so 
Uh, these felt that they were going to hold me in place. Um, they're really, really light. Take, take the paper out. Um, really light. Um, so, you can see. And yeah, looking forward to it. They look really breathable as well. You know, and actually in the Edinburgh rain, they will dry off pretty quickly as well. So, um, they are at UK, <coughs> UK 11. Excuse me. UK 11. Um, and so that's uh, probably normally a 10 and a half, but as we're trying to one, actually the magnum was the best size for me. Um, so there you go, you can, I'll show you, there you can see the sole. Um, looks like it's got decent grip uh, as well, so hopefully that will last a little while as well. So there we go, new running shoes for running it and getting that good. And actually, the guy at the shop was saying that these would be good for building up a bit of mileage as I look to train a little bit more as I'm starting off with shorter shorter kilometers and then building up to do longer ones as well. So these will suit for that as well. So there you go, Mizuno's Wave Rider 27.